what I have here is a real treat. This is a battery backup system by APC. It was pulled straight from production and I'm going to have my lamp on it now and I'm going to pull the wall outlet to simulate a power loss. Now take a look what just happened. The lamp shut off. Now you might think, well, this is old. It was pulled from production, right? Computers aren't relying to stay on and properly shut down. This is what you would expect. But let me show you something interesting. So I went ahead and plugged it back in. And I'm going to show you something that I have witnessed several times. And again, these are systems that are in production. Companies rely on these. And experts who install these are supposed to know better. And what I discovered with this is that the battery was never actually installed. They hear the beeps and they ignore it. They're not looking at it and saying, oh, what's going on? Maybe the battery's charging. I don't know what possibly they're thinking. But you can see here, I've taken the battery out, and I'm showing here, basically, you can't insert the battery the wrong way, in case you're worried. But idea is, green side goes up. When this is brand new, there's instructions. On these tabs here, it even says, green side tabs go out. Now, the system is actually going to protect and provide power of any equipment that's connected to this APC unit. So in addition to the protection, now it's gonna provide power. And you can even see from the display that it says fully charged, um, you know, all the way up. And it's not making the beep as it was before. And this is something that's so critical. When you get a piece of equipment, you really need to understand how it's gonna protect and what it's supposed to do. If the power goes off, this should easily be able to keep up a lamp on. And if you unplug it to simulate a power loss and it doesn't turn on, either the device is malfunctioning or you need to get new batteries. And in this display, it clearly shows the batteries are fully charged and it's giving you a, a measurement of 123 volts as power out. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to plug in the lamp back into this device and then I'm going to simulate again a power outage this time with a battery fully on and as you can expect or what you should expect is when I unplug it simulating a power loss the lamp should stay on it shouldn't flicker right because if it flickers that means this APC unit isn't working right it should perfectly stay on and then it'll tell us how much time it thinks it'll, it'll the batteries can keep it up for so as you can see, I've unplugged it. It's saying it's going to be up for 334 minutes. Clearly, um, you know, as the time goes on, this is an LED lamp. So don't worry so much about the number now. But what you are seeing is that the lamp stayed on. And that's the crazy part. This was pulled from a production unit. So if the power would have went out or if there would have been a brownout, right, a, a flicker of electricity, in which they're not getting power any longer, even if it's for two seconds, the entire system could have shut down because of improperly uh, configured device. In this case, they didn't read the instructions on the battery that literally said, flip the battery over, good side goes up, green side goes up, slide it in, and, and that's it, move along. So what I've had to do with this particular device is I actually went to the company that had this one installed, and they had two new ones. And I looked at the new ones, and sure enough, those two were beeping, signifying something's wrong with the batteries. But the people there just, for some reason, didn't follow through and, and ask themselves a simple question. Why is this thing beeping? Um, so I, I don't know how far you you know APC can go or these battery manufacturers can go in terms of letting the user know. Maybe it should just say no battery or something like that. I don't know. But in this case this can be put back into production. Now the batteries are a little older, so maybe you don't want to necessarily rely a server on there if you, if you think that there's a concern. But it, from my experience, you know, these are brand new batteries. They've really never been used. This is the first time they've been used other than when um, they were first tested. So, you know, take a look, make sure that you have full charge, but I'm gonna see if I can put this back into production. There's absolutely nothing wrong with this. No reason to send it to the landfill or anything. So if you have one of these devices, look in front of the display and just spend some time and see if it's blinking or if it has any issues with configuration. If you're not sure, take a look at the manufacturer site. Thanks for watching.